Alex Newell's number, independently owned from the Broadway musical Shocked, has taken the musical theater community by storm. With theater goers wondering how Alex can do this. a week. The range for independently owned is low F to high A sharp, with a tessitura or primary singing range of low G to D. The great thing about originating a role on Broadway is that the music can be tailor-made to your voice. The song's first half is essentially sung at speech level, as indicated by the sustained lines of low G. Alex even scales down to a low F. So Alex spends this time warming up before we get the first big note, the high D. And no disrespect to Miss Tammy Wynette. I can't stand by my man, he'll have to stay. Then, Alex comes right back down to speech level singing on low E. I'm independently owned and modulated. Even on the first modulation, Alex does the same vocal line that is done at the beginning, just a half tone higher. When someone reaches the top of their range, it's easier to hit the notes if they connect them to a scale or a run. On the last modulation and in independently owned, you'll see that Alex starts from way below the staff and uses a connected scale to move all the way up to high F sharp. If you notice, the orchestra is also doing the same scale as Alex to emphasize the song's heightened emotion. After the high F, Alex doesn't stay at the top of the staff like a soprano. They come right back down to sing B's and D's in the center of the voice. Which gives them the energy to scale back up to the high range to attack the high A sharp. After the high A, Alex comes back down again and uses another scale or slide to return to the top of the style. Afterward, Alex keeps the singing primarily in the center of the voice between B and D. They do all this to end the song with a massive, loud, and powerful B natural in the center of the group. So the question is, how does Alex do it? Well, Keeping the singing in the lower and lower middle voice gives you the energy to scale up to the upper middle and high range. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. Until next time.